Hey everyone, it's Elizabeth Kellerman. I am in, very excited that I'm in Nashville, Tennessee. I'm here for a workshop with Tim Horn. He recently, I discovered him because he was on the cover of a magazine his work was, and it was an airstream in the middle of the desert at sunset, just amazing work. Today I'm in, well actually this week, for about three days, I'm gonna be in Nashville at a, at a place called 521. working on this painting and working in oils, raw umber, ultramarine blue, cool yellow, alizarin crimson permanent, burnt sienna, and this is cadmium medium something. I've got this. This is my painting. that kind of helps me look at it and see it. I feel like my shadows are a little more green on the house. Um, and then I need to work these shadows, this dappled light in the foreground over. Um, something that Tim suggested when he came by was to just go ahead and take this gutter out because it's, it's not helping me. He also suggested that I darken this, which I did and this shape of this building immediately popped. Um, he gave me some other pointers, but those are the main things. Okay, I'm done with my painting for day one of my workshop. And um, painting with oils is such a relief. I can paint in light holes and trees so much better, blend them in easily, really nice. Um, Something I learned today that I think I'm going to take home with me is that I need to make my own panels. And he gave us some tips for making really lightweight panels that you could travel with. Um, Sorry, I don't have a mic on. Also learned that it's really hot and I need to wear shorts tomorrow. So, all right. All right, I'm in East Ash, Nashville on day two of my plein air workshop with Tim Horn and I'm looking for a place that I want to paint today. It's kind of, right now it's, even though there's blue sky, there's a lot of, it's very hazy, so there's not a lot of sharp shadows. Um, let me just show you. So today is Wednesday, it's the last day of the workshop, and um, I have something to share. <laughs> and that was yesterday, as I was walking around, I got to the location early, I was getting ready to set up, I saw Tim, I saw like one other artist, and I was walking around, and as I walk around, the sinking feeling set in and I was getting a migraine. Um, and then there was a bunch of, there was a landscaping crew nearby and uh, they just like pff, set it off so I like laid down in my car and put a shirt over my face um, turned on the AC so I was hoping like dark cold would help no it just got worse and worse um, I get really light sensitive and sound sensitive and it's taken me years to figure it out but um, <clears throat> so that was happening so I just went back to my hotel room and pretty much stayed there all day and then I slept at like the rest of the day and rested um, 
So today, I'm in Leaper's Fork and I feel a lot better. I'm really excited to paint makeup for yesterday. So day two was a loss, but day three hopefully will be awesome. It is so cute. It's like painter's heaven. It's got all these like historic buildings and cute lands. It's just cute. You get, if you're an artist and you're anywhere near here, you gotta come here and paint. Anyway, I'm looking for a place to paint. Um, and I think I might have found a nice spot. Uh, let me show you. I love that house with the driveway and the dappled light and the reflection off the roof. Um, oh, wow, look at those hydrangeas. Let me, let me show you those. Look at those hydrangeas. Oh, man. I just, I'm a sucker for a mass planting of hydrangeas. Those look like oak leaf hydrangeas. That would be a great painting. I mean, just this to me says welcome. Isn't that pretty? Hi, sweetheart. One eye kitty, sweetie. Kitty, kitty. Alright, I found where I'm going to paint. Um, it's right in the center of town, so I'm probably going to get interrupted a lot, but that's okay. I, I'm inspired. Um, and Tim helped me pick out my composition. Very nice. Um, he gave me some good feedback about that. So let me just show you where I, what I'm going to do. I'm really into this pole going up here and the corner of the roof, and I want to do um, a horizontal, no, a portrait style composition.
warm up my highlights a whole lot more. Okay, we ate lunch at the local barbecue place. Amazing. And um, I had okra. I had collards. And barbecue.